And not a bad looking day outside. We do have cloud coverage and really that's all today is going to be. So calm, no rain, no snow to speak of, but cloudy. So that's just how it happens for the end of the weekend. Maybe a little bit of sunshine before all of it really starts to build in, but we're tracking the next system, the next rain system that's going to come through later on tonight. On the max track, nothing, at least not as of now, but uh, give it 24 hours and then you'll start to see what we see up north eventually get closer to us. Not the snow, mind you, but the rain that will eventually come with it. In fact, you can see the boundary. This is the warm front portion. This is what passed us yesterday. That's why temperatures are actually going to go up a little bit today, despite all of the cloud coverage that's going to be in place. But behind it is an arcing cold front. What that's going to do is kind of lay right over us and just bring in, well, yeah, cloud coverage, but also a few chances for showers. So this is how it's all going to play out. Low is moving away from us, so now we're talking about the rain coming through. And it will be rain. Despite that we're getting cooler air, it's not quite getting down to freezing, at least not yet. So that's why it will be a complete rain event late tonight through most of the day tomorrow. High pressure to the south. Another reinforcing cold front is going to dig south, and that's going to come through Tuesday. So that's why temperatures take a pretty big dip middle of the work week. But then high pressure right behind it is what gets here by Wednesday, and it sticks around. And that's good news, especially for the travelers. Getting out late Tuesday, going throughout the day Wednesday and into Thursday, roads are going to be dry. No rain, no snow, nothing to really worry about, at least not in the state of Kentucky. Now you go further north, you may hit some snow, but for the most part, if you're traveling within the state or going south, you're going to be just fine coming up for this week for travel. But we do have one little system to get through, and that's the rain that comes in late tonight throughout the day tomorrow. So mainly spotty showers, light to moderate rain, nothing big expected. We're not expecting anything as far as flooding potential. I mean, really, this is just a quick hit of rain and that's about it and this is all you're going to get up to a quarter of an inch. In fact, the model projection yesterday actually had more, so it's starting to trend downward. We may just skip by with a few tenths of an inch and that's the most we'll get with this system. So for today, it's really cloudy throughout and we don't have a cat's game day, so we'll just skip that graphic for tomorrow. Showers start, but it's really I mean, late tonight into tomorrow and then by Tuesday and yeah, we're already backing off the rain. All the temperatures don't seem to match up, but you can tell that we do get a dip down to 42 on Tuesday, right back up to 58 for Friday. So yeah, towards the end of the work week, we don't have a UK game today. I'm still updating the graphics if you haven't noticed that just yet. Overnight tonight, we'll see some cloud coverage. Yes, some rain showers move through, but also a little bit of cloud coverage as well. So for your eight-day forecast, this is what you're left with. You've got one little system to get through before we get to Turkey Day. And yeah, I mean, it's looking great. Just a little bit of rain late tonight, early tomorrow morning. Nothing that we can't handle. Just a few tenths of an inch of rain. And then the cloud coverage starts to decrease. If you're traveling, your best time to do so would be any time Tuesday into the afternoon because there will maybe a few morning showers early on Tuesday. But after that point, it all clears out. The clouds start to clear. Wednesday is going to be a fantastic day to get on the roads. And if you have to travel on Thursday, if you're just going a short distance, I mean, temperatures will start out cold. You're going to want a jacket and bundle up. But no, no rain, no precipitation, no snow. That's the most important thing. So yeah, Thursday, beautiful, sunny, we'll take it. Next chance for rain gets here for the weekend, so it almost worked out perfectly this year where we get mild temperatures, lots of sun, beautiful travel days, all for Turkey Day. More news after the break.